Hello, my name is Caitlin Emery. I am a junior at Randall College of New Jersey, where I am majoring in elementary education with a concentration in history. The video you are watching is part of a virtual film festival produced as the final project in Dr. Jacob Levenz's course, Holocaust and Media. I would like to thank the Gross Center for Holocaust and Genocide Studies for sponsoring this program. The film that I will be presenting is The Diary of Anne Frank. It was directed by George Stevens and originated in the United States. The film was distributed by 20th Century Fox Film Corporation in 1959. The fi film stars Millie Perkins, Shelley Williams, Richard Beamer, Diane Baker, and many more. The Diary of Anne Frank film, the Diary of Anne Frank film is based on the novel Anne Frank, The Diary of a Young Girl. This film has won several awards, such as Best Film Promoting International Understanding by the Golden Globes and Best Cinematography Black and White by the Academy Awards. I encourage viewers to watch the trailer that will be posted to our website at rampo.edu slash holocaust. We have also included links to where the film may be streamed or purchased. I'm excited for you all to watch the Diary of Anne Frank as it really brings viewers to understand what life was like in Holland back during World War II. There are many themes that the film explores. Some are family, morality, isolation, generosity, and love. The theme of family shows the family dynamics between the Franks and the Von Dons living together for the first time and how important family actually is. Theme morality is prevalent when Anne desires to be known for something, especially through her writing, and wants a career in the future and wants to live her life. But one thing that she always loves is her writing, and she wants to be known for that. Um, their lives being in constant danger shows the theme of isolation and Anne shows generosity during Hanukkah while giving, gifting everyone something such as cigarettes, earplugs, and scarves, things that she can find around the house or make, um, or with what little money she had for the shopkeepers to go buy for her, and that shows generosity. The theme of love is shown not only when Anne values her family and loves her family, especially her dad, who she admires the most. But Anne falls in love with Peter, the Vandan son. As viewers watch this film, we can ask a number of questions, although one in particular is why we think that the Diary of Anne Frank has made an impact in the world, specifically the United States. The, Di the Diary of Anne Frank differs from other films or from the, from the canon of Holocaust cinema, because it is from the perspective of a young Jewish girl in hiding. Viewers get to understand how hard it, it was for Jews to grow up during this time. The film is more than just a young girl growing up in such a terrible time. The film is more personal. As viewers watch, we really see the character growth of Anne and how she lives with another family. When I watched the film for the first time as a young girl myself, I never knew the full meaning behind it. Although now the film is truly showing is truly showing how Anne and how she lived her life throughout the Holocaust and how her and her family tried to make the best of the situation at hand. Viewers really see the difficulties of living with another family along with growing up to be an adult and all the changes that come along with that. In addition to the struggle of rationing food between seven, seven people. The Diary of Anne Frank is set in Nazi occupied Holland in World War II. Young girl Anne Frank keeps a diary of her everyday life, discussing anywhere from family dynamics and love to the Nazi threat on Holland. Shopkeeper Crowler hides not only the Frank family, but also the Von Don family. Anne has never lived with another family before, so the struggle of finding a family dynamic is prevalent throughout the film. 
and does not have a great relationship with her mother and sister, although she relies on her father Otto a lot. Jealousy arises between the Frank sisters about the Vandan son Peter, and eventually Otto Frank, Anne's father, returns to the attic several years later to find his late daughter's diary. When watching the film, make sure you keep a lookout on the character development of Anne and how she learns to live with the Vandans. In addition to the sound effects and facial expressions that are prevalent, especially when the family is nervous about the Nazis showing up, the thief of the typewriter, or when the bombs are striking. Or when the bombs are striking and all the members of the attic are looking out the window. Lastly, make sure to pay attention to George Stevens' choice of lighting when Anne and Peter talk in Peter's room. The Diary of Anne Frank matters because most people today did not grow, grow up during the World War II. The Diary of Anne Frank matters because most people today did not grow up during World War II. Therefore, from this film, viewers learn how families like the Franks and Von Dons lived and what they had to do in order to survive, such as tiptoeing around the attic and barely speaking to one another. The members of the attic could not speak during the day, and it was not until Mr. Crowler left that they could talk to one another. I picked this film because it is a part of the New Jersey education curriculum. New Jersey was the first state to require Holocaust and genocide studies and requires Holocaust and genocide education in all elementary and secondary schools. As an elementary education major, I will be teaching about the Holocaust to this country's future. It is important that students from a young age know what kids like Anne Frank went through during World War II. I hope you all enjoyed the presentation on this film, The Diary of Anne Frank. I hope you took something away from this and the education behind it. I appreciate your attention. Thank you.